Hey guys, so today I especially want to check out 4.4.2 KitKat and see if the stock browser still kind of lags and it's a little bit slowish uh, in performance. Uh, something I did see that it was in 4.4 KitKat and in the new 4.4.1 KitKat it was a little bit slow, so it's not still the same case. Well, let's take a look at it. So, first of all, this is confirm here that we are running the latest version here, uh, which is the good stuff 4.4.2 KitKat. Came out today actually. It's pretty good stuff. Form to form to KitKat. Yeah, we are running it. Uh, you can see still the same build number here. Uh, you can see here a lot more root access kind of sucks. No! <laughs> that sucks. Uh, okay, whatever. So, let's open up Google Chrome here. And let's try to zoom in. And it, it feels, I, I'm not sure if I'm wrong about this, but it actually feels like it could be that they improved the performance here uh, in this new version here. But still, uh, I can see how they can make it better. Uh, I think definitely that it's a little bit slow here it's zooming in when in terms of touch sensitivity. Uh, when I drag my fingers out, like the first part when I'm dragging them out, it, it doesn't feel like it's reacting the way it should uh, in, in terms of, I mean, I have to zoom in like, or take my fingers out like this to zoom in a little bit. It feels like they, they should have me speed that up. So uh, when I'm already like this, it should already be focused in uh, on that part. But here I have to do even more and you can see how my fingers I have to do like two times. And I don't think that it should have to be like that. I definitely think that they could fix that. Uh, because that's it's a little bit annoying for me personally. In terms of going up and down, definitely feels good. Definitely feel, but why do I have to do it like three times almost to go out of the screen? Feels a little bit like an iPhone, uh, but iPhones can kind of do that, I think, because they do have small displays. I just think that they're doing it. Uh, but this one is just like, wow, they really have to zoom in or drag my fingers out like this and not even get zoomed in even more. Uh, it's a little bit weird, but it definitely feels like the speed, if I'm not wrong about this, it definitely feels like the speed is better here in, in terms of frame rate and how smooth it, or going in and out that it's better at least than what it has been in early update. But that's just me uh, looking at it and uh, kind of feeling what I feel and maybe I'm wrong about that. I can't be wrong. I mean, I'm wrong all the time, almost. You can see that they don't have this uh, going back thing, going back to the next page, like Apple has that are pre-cache or something. Uh, but it has a very, very nice tab system here inside of Google Chrome, which, which I do enjoy a ton. Let's see here, can we go into Oh yeah, that guy is he's dead, I guess. He's dead. What has he up supposed to do with Apple? I don't know. Do I really have to go in here? I guess. Yeah, I, th I, th I think that they can change it this here, that it's better. It's a little bit better. Seems like Apple is doing some kind of Christmas theme here uh, with the graphics and all. Or maybe it's just something else. You never know with Apple. But why? I never know why. But the, why doesn't the Google Chrome browser like has, have a reading mode? Should have a reading mode or something where you can read text. Maybe it has. I, I haven't seen it though. Uh, it would be amazing if they fixed that. If they don't have that. So yeah, let's quickly look here. Peace out.